um, it looks like from a historical standpoint that black black bodies and black people and black minds don't mean much to, to mm -hmm. the culture we live in. Mm -hmm. And that's ever prevalent right now in culture. If you turn on the media, we throwing our own people under the bus for yeah. for the back. Yeah, they, they, they literally wait until we die. Then they praise everybody. 100%. Think about it. If you look at Nipsey Hussle, Nipsey Hussle didn't sell that many records when he was alive. Soon as he passed, how could the same records that he made back then go triple platinum, all this stuff, and went from, could, like, let's be honest, even, like, nobody talked to him, but all of a sudden, he had a funeral in the Staples Center. Even Takeoff, you look at Takeoff, people don't want to talk about it because we say the truth hurt, yeah. and the truth really hurt. We didn't really hear that much about Takeoff right. until... Till he passed. Till he passed. Yeah, now all of a sudden, he was the best one. He was, the, and it's like that's why I was saying, like, give people their flowers. Why? I tell people all the time, even my people, man, I don't need nothing when I'm not here. I don't even want no funeral. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like we doing this now while we here. While we here. Why don't you want a funeral? Because I don't. You like, what, what you gonna do when we not here? I just want some people to look in my face and be now. Nah, mm -hmm. Celebrate us now. Let's go get this bread. Let's help people change the world while we're here. We can't do nothing when we're not here. Yeah. And so that's my thing. It's because also too, I don't want to. I don't want to be looking at all these fake people faces. Mm. Understood. You don't want the energy at the. Point. I don't want it. Cause guess what? You know how people be. Oh, we were best friends. <laughs> yeah, no, but think about it. Then when you was around, you couldn't do. You couldn't yeah. get a quarter from them. Yeah, that's real. Uh, that's even real. they time, and you say, look, man, we got this thing, let's go do this time thing. Like, nah, I'm like, nah, man, like, let's celebrate us now. That's the page I'm on. That's true. In your, in your head, back when you tore your ACL in Houston, yeah. and you went back to the crib, yeah. I believe this is the time frame, and you walked with your grandfather to the yeah. hospital, yeah. and they gave um, your grandfather the wrong medicine at that time. Yeah. That to me personified what they think of us, because yeah. they're not doing that to anybody else. They're yeah. not doing that to uh, uh, people with money at that point in time. Right. They're not doing that to, to people with different. Well, different we colors we, of skin. we getting experimented on. Think about Absolutely. it. Yeah. We don't have no money. We don't have no insurance. So whatever, you know, we got the the lowest totem pole of the people working on us. Mm -hmm. And so even with my grandfather, we had to go to the veteran hospital because that's all he had. And, and and he always told me, he was like, son. We need to start our own on. We need to start our own business. That's what he was saying. It's like, because they don't care about us, which it's a lot of people in the world that can change now because we look at African-American black people now. They know that we are creative. We're doing all these different things. But the one thing that, that I look at in my life that I've seen, education, knowledge is the most important thing. And I just think that we're not educating us because all we think about is the dollar. And so when we change that, just like you said, when we start caring about each other, think about they're grouping up. We're not grouping up. Yeah. We're trying to destroy each other. And so, you know, like I said, we, I mean, look at the guy that played Black Panther. That movie now is another Chadwick, movie. Yeah. Look, look, look at this. Look at his life, right? Uh, what's the guy that played Iron Man? They pay him $20 million a movie. Oh, wow. man, we have this, con we have this conversation all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This, guy got, yep. this, this guy got $500,000. And then probably when he passed, another one point five mm -hmm. or something to his mm -hmm. family, which is crazy. You see Stephen A. Stephen a. Smith's salary yes. compared to his counterparts. Yes. They dwarf his salary, right. and he's working 24-7. Yeah. I mean, he's the reason we watch the show. ESPN. He's the reason yeah, why we watch the show. ESPN. 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 And then they put him in these situations. Because if you're watching the, what's going on nowadays, they put him in these situations where it's clear. But think about this, though, right? Do we know our value? So Talk about we that. Get You stuff, don't think at this point we no, do? No, we do. But still, at the time, we got to take what we can take. We got to take what we can take. You know why we got to take what we can take? Because we dwelling on the past. We keep talking about what they've done to us. I keep telling people we can't change the past, but we can change the future. We can't change what we came from, but we can change where we're going. I tell people all the time that I might not be where I want to be at right now, right? But I'm glad I'm not where I used to be. So a lot of people just get caught up because they like, oh, man, this person hating on me and these people, that's cool. Yeah. But we could make these changes if we even 
keep it 100 with each other. Think about it. But we lived like we was taught. When I grew up, everybody was taught to be a kingpin. So you don't even care about nobody. You just want to stand on the top of the throne. I was going to say, elaborate on that for people who might not get that message. <laughs>